Katie Holmes, Jamie Foxx caught making out. Were Katie Holmes and Jamie Foxx really caught making out? That's what a tabloid wants readers to believe, but there's actually no evidence to back up the contention. Gossip Cop can bust the seemingly manufactured story. As was widely reported, Holmes helped Fox celebrate his birthday earlier this month. The only photographic evidence to emerge of them interacting at the star-studded gathering was a 20-second video of the pair talking on a stage surrounded by other people. But now okay? Is skinning this as a sexy celebration that's proof they're slowly but surely coming out of the relationship closet. At the bash, claims the gossip magazine, Holmes and Fox didn't hold back on the PDA. It's alleged the actress joined her boat on the dance floor, where the so-called source claims they full made out. The outlet even contends this make-out session took place in full view of attendees such as Leonardo DiCaprio and Snoop Dogg. The publication doesn't explain why, if the pair was really kissing in public, the only footage that surfaced merely shows them chatting. It's also suspicious that the tabloid asserts the duo reportedly followed up the public love fest with a cozy weekend at the Shutters Hotel in Santa Monica. If OK, really is a source, as it purports, shouldn't it be able to confirm whether or not the cozy weekend actually happened, instead of just claiming it reportedly did? Well, gossip copters have real insiders. And we already busted claims that Holmes and Fox had a romantic weekend at Shutters in California. In actuality, she was in New York the whole time. The magazine chides Holmes and Fox to give it up, guys when it should really be directing that admonishment to itself. This is an outlet that just weeks ago falsely claimed she was pregnant with the actor's baby. Not only is that untrue allegation not mentioned in this new story, but it's also notable that no reputable publication similarly alleged the pair were seen making out at his birthday party. On the contrary, Entertainment Tonight specifically reported that Holmes and Fox didn't show any PDA. Case closed.